Matt Kent's is staying hooked right to the rear bumper of his teammate next up cup, Mark Martin in the six car. Let's see what happens here going off into turn one. Nobody jumps out of line. Stewart, big advantage. Uh oh, uh -oh. who's off the track? Boy, Max Pappas on that 16 car. He got about four or five spots, it looked like. Scott, Scott Sharp paid the price. He was the first car on the outside. He got out in the uh, loose stuff. Not as badly as Martin Truex did. He's still trying to get no. oh, got problems here. Sharp and Hornish crash. A uh, yellow flag. I don't know if, if Scott Sharp maybe didn't get his tires cleaned off or what happened going down into turn one or he was just so high he got out in the marbles. Well, remember what we talked about at the beginning of the race. Max Pappas had told me how ill these things drive for the first three corners on low air pressure where they drop the pressure down knowing how much the pressure they're going to build up over the course of a run. The car almost just won't turn. So the Wilton, Connecticut road racer Scott Sharp goes from second to the back of the pack, and Sam Hornish is going to need some help getting restarted. Let's have another look at it, see if we can find out what happened to Scott Sharp at turn one. Side to side to Stewart, back to the start-finish line. Brakes. No contact. In the oh. 10, forced him off the racetrack. And then Hornish gets into the back of him. Hornish in the 06 car. What was that He's got to feel like there's a bullseye on that 08 car. And there's where he got back into Hornish. Uh, I know he got him back, but not on purpose, I don't think. He's going backwards. Yeah, I wouldn't put that in the payback department. <laughs> oh, let's ride along with Sam Hornish. Gosh, see ya. He just drilled Sharp in the middle of the straightaway. But Sharp will be back. Oh, hello. Ooh, did That's you hear that? <laughs> that was a sharp hit. No pun intended. Not at all. All right, Sam's gotten refired. He's going to come around and join the field. He has destroyed that man's car, though. High rock and roll. 